Hi there. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can install auto hotkey on Windows platform and create a script that will automate your opening a blank text file in notepad task. So let's start by downloading the auto hotkey. Go to autohotkey.com website. You'll find something similar to this page. In future, this page may be changed to something different, but there will be download button on this screen or you just scroll to the bottom and you'll find download link. Clicking on download link will start the installer and after that, you'll find auto hotkey installed on your system and then main file you'll find auto hotkey folder with the help file setup exe then hk to exe converter so this is pretty much how the process goes so let's start by creating a script go to your desktop right click on it and then select new tab okay then choose auto hotkey script i'm going to rename this to open notepad okay and i'm going to edit the script now what i'm going to do is I'm going to create a command where I'm pressing at least a combination of two keys and I'm opening notepad with the help of that. So first thing is type hash or pound symbol then set and then colon twice. Then you have it will run then notepad and then max now save this okay and now let's execute this so you're gonna right click on this file and select run script this will open up to what instance in your tray and now let's use windows key and Z button this opens blank text file in notepad let's see if we can do another okay so let's edit the script okay now here I'm going to have another one and control B for some other program let's say something like Finam okay now I'm going to close this one and see if it runs okay so there is already instance running so we have to close it or replace it so I have one more instance here okay so let's check out Windows key and N or let me check the combination P combination was Windows key and then P this should open up Winamp and this should also open up notepad so as long as we have our instance of auto hot key loaded we can run notepad and win up there is also one thing to note here is that selecting this key only runs this program and not this one in some instances you'll find selecting this key combination also runs this by bypassing this key combination so these are some of the things that you learn while you 
create your automation scripts with AutoHot key. There are plenty of information available in documentation, tutorials, and in support forms. You can also learn from scripts of other people and you can make sure to automate your tough tasks and make use of this library for saving your time. So I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions or any suggestions, then do let me know in the comments. Thank you.